I was, I was, everyone was talking crap about hip, Hypnos the other day, and I'm like, I love Hypnos, and also we have this plush Hypnos that we're going to be giving away right now. <laughs> <laughs> so what is, okay, I have not played Hades. What, mm, what, yeah. give me mm. the Hypnos elevator pitch. Okay, so uh, Hypnos is the Greek god of sleep. Mm -hmm. He is the uh, brother of Thanatos, the god of death. Right. And they're both uh, sons of Nyx, the god of night. Mm -hmm. um, they live in the house of Hades mm. with you. Yep. Um, Hypnos, Hades, another game that just stone cold hotties. Yeah, <laughs> front to front to finish, All front to back, wall to wall. In yep. a loose sense, mm -hmm. they can be thought of as your characters, I guess, step brothers. Yes. Yeah, you, you, they're sort of raised in the same house mm -hmm. uh, by the same mother. Yeah. Yes. Um, and so, uh, Hypnos comes into uh, when you when you come back to the house or when spirits enter the house. Hypnos is there and has a list of all of the people who have died and is greeting people as they come in. Yes. And has a has lists of why they died. Right. So in the context of the game, ah. which is a roguelike, yes. uh, when you um, die and come back to the house, he will greet you and be like, oh, Megara got you, huh? <laughs> and things like that. Yeah. Give you like, a little why like... Why didn't you try dodging her attacks? <laughs> it's like, ooh, a <laughs> trap. You should watch out for those. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And yeah. you're just like, shut up. <laughs> He's a chatty, well-meaning boob, is what you're telling me? Yes. He yeah. Is, yeah. A mm. debatably well-meaning. Uh, oh, my brother from another mother. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's the game. It's the game, kind of just twisting the knife. Like mm -hmm. when you, yeah, when you a die and bit. go for another run. Mm -hmm. it's, yeah, yeah. Big nanny nanny poo poo energy. Mm. Yep. He's also one of the only characters that is uniformly nice to you all the time. Uh, uh, because uh, no one else ever is the entire time. Yeah. You win people over, but you don't have to win him over. He's airheaded enough to like you already. Mm -hmm. He's an airhead too? Yeah. Oh, he's my brother from another mother. Yeah. He's also, like, he's the god of sleep. So every time you walk up to him, he does a little animation where he wakes up and sort of tosses his list and grabs it. Oh. It's very adorable. Uh, we're just waiting on uh, uh, our... Engineering is having a, a touch of an issue in logging back into everything, so they're going to uh, get that up on the screen when they get a chance. Um, but we'll have a look at that. There we go. Oh. That's our huggable hypno stall. This is uh, very handmade cute. by Beanie's Buddies. That's amazing. Um, who I think is in chat. I think I saw them in there. Um, huh. It says here that you crashed the bus. Have you tried not doing that? that that's hypnos energy right there. Um, there is no escape from the desert bus, so why not make yourself comfortable by taking your very own Chthonic companion along for the ride? Everyone's favorite underworld door greeter, Hypnos. Inspired by the character from Supergiant Games Hades, this 20-inch stuffed animal version of Sleep Incarnate is sure to provide you with sweet dreams wherever your journey takes you. Hypnos was meticulously handmade over the span of 35 plus hours using no. cotton, oh, velvets, wow. art yarns, felts, and faux fur with huggability in mind. Useful for cuddling as you drift off to sleep, watching that comfort movie with you on the couch, or adding a bit of drowsy cheer to your collector shelf. The, his clothing is fully removable for washing or playing dress up. The prize winner will be, will be provided with care instructions. As... 20 so... He's tall. Yeah. It's a big, yeah. it's a okay, pretty, this is a big one. That's okay. a, that's uh, a big one right there. I like, much smaller, but this is... This is a very he, large yeah, and there's yeah. a couple other things that it comes with. Uh, as if having the God of Sleep in squishy format wasn't enough, he comes with a few extra perks to reward your generous donation. A matching human-sized sleep mask, a replica of his ever-growing list embroidered with the Desert Bus logo, and a replica Chthonic coin purse for holding all of your loose change for the boatman. Wow, yeah. that's amazing. I love the sleep cool. mask that he comes with. That looks like a nice sleep mask, too. Like, it's got, like, the soft stuff around the elastic for mm -hmm. cushion cushioning this. Yeah. Um, hey, if you want coins uh, to put in your Chthonic coin purse, uh, you can go over to uh, Heroic Replicas. They have a bundle that they are selling that includes, amongst other things, a, one of the Hades Obel, and they are donating money from that to Child's Play. So, so cool. Yeah, definitely I go check that. that out. So what should we run um, this for? Uh, we do have a suggestion in here for $6.66. 
because you are in hell. Yeah. I mean, that, yeah, although that's that's more that's of like more a Christian, Christian. Yeah, 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 that's a Christian than, thing. I'm thinking that a healthy uh, night's sleep is about eight hours for some people, right? So maybe eight dollars mm. and something. Mm. That's not bad. I, um, I haven't played the game. I have no. Are there are there meme numbers? <laughs> I mean, what is our sleep number? <laughs> um, uh, eight dollars. There's an. I can't think of any like meme numbers from the game. Well, all the um, characters are hot, so it could be eight sixty nine. We did that joke already. So oh, unfortunately. okay. <laughs> um, uh, Oh, three for dog heads. Mm. Eight eighty three. Eight eight thirty three. Yeah, I like that. It yep. also looks like the face he makes when he greets you, just like yeah, wide actually, open. Yeah, actually, that's very correct. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, the eight yeah. three. Yep. All right. It's very hypnos face. Mm. So we're gonna do eight dollars and thirty three cents, uh, and we're going to run that until what time is it? One fifty one. Run until about two thirty. Yeah, yeah, I think yeah, two thirty yeah, is a great yeah, yeah. time to. Sure, we'll run that until two thirty. Uh, so get your dollar, your donations of eight dollars and thirty three cents. And if um, Joe wants to just keep playing the uh, Hades soundtrack, I could listen to this thing all day. I, you know what? I gotta hand it to a character. He's just been woken up, but he does not look like he's in a bad mood. No, no, that's Hades you know. is all or uh, Hypnos is always in a good mood. <laughs> he gets I could to talk sleep. about Hades for. Um, for, for a very long time. A long time. It's, Me as well. It's Me as one well. of my favorite games. Ooh, yeah. I've heard mm -hmm. it's so good, and I've heard that even if you're terrible at video games like I am, you can you can play Hades. Yeah, I think mm -hmm. so. Mm -hmm. It's a very, as far as roguelikes go, it's very accessible. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I enjoy the um, the loop conceit, the death conceit. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What is Erica's favorite Hades character? Uh, that's... Uh, Beam the Chow in chat there that asked that question. That is the crafter. Um, Hephaestus? No. Wait, Hephaestus isn't in the game. But his hammer is, I think. That's uh, Daedalus. Or Daedalus, yeah. Uh, my favorite is Dusa. The floating Gorgon head. I, I am a huge sucker for um, any any representation of Medusa mm. in, in myth. Um, so... And and like she is, she is technically one of the romanceable options, and it's a very interesting story arc that you go through with her mm. as Zagreus. I um, I really enjoy it, so I definitely I would ha definitely have to go with Deuce on that. All right. TQ is saying Artemis is the correct answer in our Slack. So uh, Artemis Artemis is also very very good. Don't get me wrong. Lesbian representation. Her mm -hmm. and Callisto that she talks about. Yep. <sighs> All right. What else do we have to do? We did lot. We did lotter than words. Um, I think, I I'm think for actually, Orpheus, honestly. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Say that again. Oh, I think my favorite character is Orpheus. Yeah. I'm just always a sucker for the Orphic myth. I identify quite strongly with uh, lovesick poets who just keep screwing everything up. This is a bit of a jump, but Cameron, have you ever experienced the Hades Town um, musical? No. It is the Orphic myth, myth mixed with the Hades and Persephone myth. Mm -hmm. Oh, interesting. Done as like a sort of blues and bluegrass, rust belt rust hmm. belt music style okay it's interesting. very interesting I, I it's one of my favorite musicals hmm. um